What's up, cellar dwellers? This is Overlord Dan and Mrs. Overlord. Hi. Bringing you another installment of the movie Cellars Month of Horrors. <laughs> ah. Tonight, we watch Scream, the 1996 teen slasher comedy extravaganza. <laughs> it is all of those things. It's all all of that and more. <laughs> so, it starts out with a great opening scene where we get Drew Barrymore mm -hmm. as apparently a teenager. But this had to have been like around like 50 first dates, right? No. No. <laughs> way, way before that. Way before that. What about Wedding Singer? Way before that. Oh, shit. I don't know. Anyway. So she's home alone. The killer calls her on the phone. That whole thing happens. Her boyfriend gets gutted. And then she gets killed and hung from a tree. Which is a really serious opening. It is. It doesn't. It really doesn't fit the rest of no, the movie. No, it doesn't because the rest of the movie is like goofy as hell. Yeah. Because later in the movie, one of the very next kills, a girl gets crushed in a cat door in a garage door. That's my favorite kill. She's crawling through the cat door and gets her head cracked open. I wish I could have just, broken. like, why? What makes you think that that's a good idea, crawling through the cat door? Well, you know, she's, she's running from the killer. What's she going to do? You know? I guess. You got to do what you got to do. And that's what she had to do. But it didn't work out for her. No. So. Anyway. Um, and then there's the big battle at the end. There's the big party. The wedding singer was 1998. So this seems like was only two, two years, years later. later. So it's right around the same time. Okay. So then there's the big party. And we have the reveal that the killer is actually two people. <gasps> yeah. No. Which is how he could be like everywhere at once. Two people. Two people. And, uh, you know, sh and you know, she didn't really him. ever click with me. I just kind of thought that that, I thought it was the one dude, the goofy dude. Stu? Yeah. And that he was just really fast. Matthew Lillard. <laughs> he's really funny. He's so good in it. I especially love it when Billy like stabs him a bunch of times. And he's like, I think he stabbed me too many times, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm dying. And then he's like asking Sid, he's like. He's like, did you really call the cops? And she's like, yeah. He's like, my parents are going to be, be so funny. mad at me. <laughs> yeah, he's really funny. He's super funny. And Dewey, the cop, is also super funny. Mm -hmm. Um, Played by David Arquette. He's super goofy. I feel like this video is getting longer. <laughs> no, it's not. It's great length. It's a perfect are amount really of time. Are we really only at three minutes? Yeah, you ready? Let's get into it. Okay. All right. We're doing thumbs categories. up, thumbs down on the categories. <laughs> All right, here we go. Fire, I feel like quick the fire. Category starts, you know, like in um, the millionaire who wants to be a millionaire. Yeah. When like it was like. Doo -doo -doo -doo. That's what happens. <laughs> do 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 do. Category time. <laughs> quick fire. Right. Gore. Yes. Thumbs up thumbs on the up. gore. Lots of gore. We like the guts. Guts. The guts from Steve Lots in the beginning. Lots of blood. Lots of blood. Blood everywhere. Good times. Even cornstarch. Corn syrup. Corn syrup. Corn syrup. It's, yeah, good. Music. Meh. Meh. Music's okay. There's like no, no music. No good music. Mid-90s movie. We're expecting more out of you, mid-90s movie. We want some of those classic 90s jams. Exactly. General ambiance. I don't understand this category. <laughs> it's like, does the does it feel creepy? Like, is it spooky? Like, Friday the 13th, no, you know? It's in a it cabin, doesn't. in but the when, dark, no, in the it woods, doesn't. It in doesn't. the rain. It doesn't, but when you say ambiance, I think, like, like a candlelit dinner. <laughs> yeah, that would be scary. A candlelit dinner would be scary. <laughs> no. So, that's because you're setting a mood. That's the whole point. I know, but I guess... So, does just... the setting set a good mood for the movie? No. Okay, so that's a thumbs down? That's a thumbs down. All right, I like that. Uh, creativity. No, I don't think it's very creative. See, I think it's super creative. Because it's like a parody of a all these other movies. White men killing people? That's what a parody is. It's Ooh, taken it's all... So creative. It's taken all of those tropes and it's putting them all together in a funny way. It's almost like 
it hasn't been the story since the beginning of time. Their whole point is that it is the story since the beginning of time. Is that That's why point? you have Randy through the whole movie going, oh yeah, you gotta look behind you. Oh yeah, you gotta stay a virgin. Oh yeah. Jamie, look behind you. And his name's Jamie Kennedy, by the way. So yeah, that's like a meta joke. Jamie, look behind you. Listen to all of your trivia. This I know. is sounding like one of George's videos. Stop that. Jump scares. Ha! Ah! Ha! None. None none jump scares. I thought there were jump scares, but I think that they give you too much build up beforehand. Okay, there's a jump scare for you. <laughs> All right. Nobody nobody wants to see that. What? You know, what you were just doing. What you were just miming. Oh. This isn't one of those videos. It's the wrong. This is for YouTube. I'm sorry. That's all right. <laughs> Lasting <laughs> impact. Lasting impact. Is this one going to sit with you? Going to make you have a hard time sleeping? No, but it's clearly made an impact. I mean, the movie was made in 1996, and it's what? It's still like the top-selling Halloween costume. That's true. That's true. It's a scary mask. I wouldn't say it's the most famous mask. I'd say either Jason or Mike Myers beats it out, but it's it's a, it's up there for sure, the scream mask. Ew. Oh, <laughs> the dog just burped on her. <laughs> Overall, overall, what's your overall impression of the movie? One to ten? No, thumbs up or thumbs down. All oh, right, <laughs> thumbs up. I agree, thumbs up. I'd give it a solid Total seven because this is arbitrary. <laughs> <laughs> and a seven's not. <laughs> I think it's really funny, but I don't think it's so funny that you lose like any suspense. I think there's still no, moments. No, it's definitely where... that funny that you lose. Suspense. No, like you're totally into it. There's no suspense in the movie. You don't want to see... We already covered that. You don't want to see the girl survive at the end? You know she's going to survive. Well, you know that in every movie. Well, right, but there's really very little suspense. And it's and the humor is definitely like... She's wrong. Makes she's it... She's wrong. Very suspenseful. All right, we agree, though. Thumbs up all the way around. <laughs> we agree it's a thumbs up, right? We agree on that. I don't understand what's happening right now. All right. We'll see you tomorrow night on another installment of The Movie Sellers Month of Horror.